All right, guys, so one of the things that I did when we're coming out here to see 2F performance is I shipped doors through my airline. I got a driver's side and a passenger side door in this rental car. We're gonna take it to 2F performance and uh, we are gonna give them these metal doors for GT86 and they're gonna make us fiberglass doors. So I'm really excited to bring them these products and uh, I can't wait to get my fiberglass doors made. <laughs> we are driving. Apparently we are here. Here's the directions. We are here. This is Jess, by the way. Hello. What's up? And we are, look, I see race car trailer. We must be in the right place, because this looks gangster. I'm gonna be like, Paco, where are you taking me? I don't even see any signs, but let's, let's see, let's see. There's a stingray. There is. You wanna hear something funny? That's not Paco's shop. <laughs> but luckily it's right across, it's like right over there. So we're gonna, we're just gonna drive across the parking lot. Can you see my face? I'm like in the camera. Hello. We're here. This is this is the place. But no one's here. We're gonna find them. Does someone live in there? I don't think so. Looking at this Corvette, cause look, they're they're making some cool parts of that. See? Look at that. You know what they're making. Is that a Z? What else is back here? Ugh. Rawls of the of the video. This is all getting cut out. These, okay. are, these are outtakes. <laughs> it's here. You can't tell. Did you just throw that at me? Yeah. What is that? That would have like stuck to me. <laughs> Click subscribe and all that shit. Look at, look at these over fenders. They're sick. And I love how they like wrap around. So you, the only competitor you have is the HD, HDK. And they make their separate, like they don't, this part isn't Stop included, it stops. And I, I know like some people, sorry, some sorry. people cut this off, but if you need it, it's there. Neat. You know, so that way you can like, yeah, the other half is right Neat. there. Um, it's gonna be sick. Yeah. They, they fit pretty good, like make your car complete. These are my trunks. My whole re my whole booty, my whole rear is gonna be fiberglass. Yeah. Race car. That's how it is, right? <laughs> <laughs> Not for them. Yeah. Okay, so for installing So them. basically, we just like put like a metal plate on the bottom. Mm -hmm. This is like right here. Yeah. Weld that with two rods to the bottom of the car. Okay. So that plate holds the whole thing in place and you can put your, your hood pins to that plate. Sure. But then if you get hit, you just wrap that and bend it back. Yeah. And it's, you know, you can bend it as many times sure, as you sure. want. And that way you don't need to do any structure, any tubing that's gonna hold it in place. Okay, cool. And as long as this stays held by something down here, uh -huh. basically the part will stay on the car. Okay. And then just like, you know, rib it all the way down. Yeah, like rib nuts. And then what about the connection point here from so the left to the this right? this one, we like to, like, you know, we put the other, the other part against it, uh -huh. but then we bolt the whole thing together to a separate metal piece, okay. weld it on the, onto the car. That way, if somebody hits you on one side, it doesn't push the other side. Oh, okay. Because that way, the other side doesn't get ripped off. Sure, sure. So everything's like held to this metal point, so maybe just this one crushes in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the other one stays in place. Okay. And if like if this were to like completely crack and separate since it's if fiberglass, you, you yeah. Can... If you can, if you want, you can just cut this off. If you want more room in the back, you're doing like rear radiator, whatever. Yeah, yeah. You can just cut it off right here. Okay. And still, this will hold everything in place. Cool. At the end of the day, basically, the the trunk skin is gonna give you the extra the, the width. Room. So yeah. for whatever reason, you know. It gets a little bent out of place, put the trunks in place until everything fits. Okay, so that's the install for the over. What about the trunk? Is there anything I need to know about the trunk for installation? Not or really, it's pretty straightforward. Really. Mostly, we just. Uh, it's probably gonna roll. It's there okay. Go. We just. A lot well, more than happy to a person. Couple hood pins in the corner, couple okay. hood pins right here. Okay. And the whole thing stays together. Okay, cool. 
So it makes it very easy, you know, to remove them. Will my, um, my touch fingerprint sensor latch still work? My electronic factory? You can add it if you want. You gotta get all fancy in there. Why not? <laughs> Or you could like put like one of those like like the the push button uh, <laughs> pins right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretend like yeah, the uh, the yeah. um, what are they called? Click latches or whatever. Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you know, it's mostly for the shape. Yeah, of course. Most people end up like like cutting holes and whatever just to make them. And this this is just to keep this from bowing. From flopping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. All right, guys. Well, that concludes our shop tour. Paco, thanks for having us out. Thanks for hooking us up on the parts. Thanks for watching the video. We'll talk to you guys soon. See ya.